First tonight, people living in a Round Rock apartment complex are under a voluntary evacuation after today's rain washed away the soil nearby. And because that apartment building is now on potentially unstable ground, management at the complex is urging people who live there to get out. KXAN's Kylie McGivern live at the Lone Oak Apartment Homes in Round Rock to show us this problem. Kylie? Well, Robert and Shannon, the area behind me, we're told, is the site of a future apartment complex. Now, just to give you an idea, if you look at this fence back here, there is a rock at the bottom of that fence. That gives you an idea just how far this ground extended at one time. And as we walk over this tree here, well, that used to be standing on solid ground where we are. We were told this afternoon around 1 o'clock is when that fell. Now, here is the real concern, the safety concern that we're talking about here. Look how close the edge of this cliff, easily about a 20-foot drop, is to this apartment complex building. That red line there, really the only separation between the two. Here's a better look before the sunset at the scope of this concern. Again, we are at Lone Oak Apartment Homes and Management. Their team put a letter on each apartment door tonight, urging people who live inside to temporarily relocate until these repairs can be made, understandably, as you're seeing where we are right now. The complex is covering the cost of tenants to stay at a nearby hotel tonight. And we spoke with one woman who lives here who tells us this construction site has really been presenting a problem for a while now. Pretty scary, um, you know, having lived here a year, this has never been an issue before. But over the last few months, we've really watched this ground just disintegrate, you know, before our eyes. And now, Jillian Wilson, who you just heard from, she lives more at the front of this apartment building. She said that she's going to stick it out tonight, but really the concern is growing for more rain expected in the coming days and what this is going to mean at a place that is home for so many. And there are a lot of questions tonight about why this area that we're seeing here was not stabilized sooner. A lot of questions for the city and those that are developing this area. We have reached out to the city of Round Rock, who is working to get us answers, and we're going to bring you the latest and what we learn coming up tonight at 10 o'clock. But for now, reporting live in Round Rock, Kylie McGivern, KXAN News.